Now on to analytics for Confluence and how you can use data to drive decisions across your team. The problem we're solving for analytics is that many admins without visibility into the usage of their Confluence site, spaces and pages, can't realize the return on their investment in Confluence or make educated decisions about their content. So what we did to solve this was add analytics on multiple levels. Starting with site analytics, you can see a summary here of usage over time and change the date range or group by different time increments. With a list of all the spaces on your site sorted by usage, you can make better decisions around your content, considering which spaces are shiny examples of Confluence best practices or which are stale and need to be archived. With the user list, you can see who's most active and you can also go in and see which search terms are most common on your site. Search analytics let you see if employees are able to find the documents they need and determine which content should be renamed or distributed. Consider maybe there are a ton of search terms um, for a certain word, but you don't have any pages that match that. You can make sure that you rename your pages to match up with search terms. On to space analytics, you can get a very similar overview, um, but scope down to the level of a space. So you can see the same sort of uh, time range and um, group by different time the same way you would on the site level. Um, you can also go in and get a list of all of the pages where you can assess the most effective content based on usage and views and decide which you could make maybe into templates or which pages are ready for archiving. Um, and again, you have the whole list of active users here, which lets you know which employees are Confluence champions and helps you decide maybe if they could go and run some onboarding sessions um, and you can also see who maybe needs a little bit of extra help getting onboarded to Confluence and, and starting up with their documentation. And my personal favorite here is page analytics. Um, each page comes with these analytics where you can get a snapshot of overview usage. Um, and my personal favorite part of this feature is the detailed view where you can see whose reader page and what version they saw. This helps you decide whether you need to circulate information. Consider if you have an important meeting coming up. With page analytics, you can understand who's seen the agenda and necessary information beforehand. Um, and if not, then you can send the page out again and make sure the meeting will really be an effective use of everyone's time. And as a product manager, I use this all the time. <laughs>